All right, guys, I want to do a quick review here of the Browning Strike Force Elite HD. It's a sub micro uh, camera. Got it for 120 bucks off of eBay. Shipped. It says it's a 10 megapixel uh, pictures, 0.4 second trigger speed. I believe that when I test it. And it says it has up to 100 feet of night or illumination. On this side of the box, um, it supports up to a 32 gig XD video card or SD card. I'm sorry, um, 1280 by 720 high definition video, including audio, which I'll be testing that extensively. Uh, it, says it can capture up to 10,000 images on six AA batteries. Uh, of course, the 0.4 second trigger speed. On the back, here's what it says: it has a few things listed, just basically features. On this side of the box here, we have the 10 mega, megapixel pictures, the 100 foot R illumination. It says it has a time lapse mode where um, it will also take infrared trigger images as well as time lapse in the same uh, mode. So we'll test that out. Something about no noise image capture. Um, we'll see what that's all about later. And um, up to eight rapid fire shots in two seconds says it has zero blur technology. Um, infrared cameras are real prone to uh, have motion blur at, on, on nighttime pictures. So we'll see how that works. Um, all in all, it looks like a, a pretty nice camera. So we're going to open the box here and I'll let you guys see what's all in it. All right, so I got the camera out of the box here. Uh, this flip comes in a nice... Uh, little clamshell package here I just flipped it over um, got your instructions and uh, looks like a little uh, CD disc in there with some type of program um, who, knew, who, who reads instructions right uh, it looks like it uh, that's a little security thing down at the bottom um, it comes with a strap and obviously the camera so let's see if I can get this thing open here one handed So you got your strap, and you got the camera. Uh, this is, you know, it's pretty small, pretty small camera. Nice camo. You've got a cable lock pass through on the back. Of course, that's where your um, strap goes. Has uh, a set right there for uh, a tripod. If you want to mount that on a tripod mount, there's the latch. The latch just looks like a good sturdy latch. Alright, the bottom just opens up. Here's where you have all your controls. Pretty self-explanatory there. The battery box is on the bottom. There is a push button that releases the battery box. The battery box slides out. Uh, I've seen several Moultrie cameras have the same feature. If I can get it out there. So I'll put some batteries in it and we'll get it out in the woods. Thanks guys.